been at it for about a solid, uh, solid 50 minutes or so. Um, so besides doing pad work, uh, when I go to really start prepping for a show, I, I like to just start playing whatever I've been listening to lately. I like to listen to stuff that inspires me um, as a part of my preparation. So besides pad work, I like to do that. I like to try to get um, a good 45 minutes to an hour of just constantly moving. When I feel like I'm, I'm chopping out or something, I'll just, I'll, I'll stop it. I'll go to the next track. I just try to keep, try to keep my hands moving, try to keep my feet moving, but, but not cramping up, not, not, not playing something that I actually can't handle because I want to make sure that my practice here is functional. Uh, I want to make sure that I'm I'm moving at the right speed and I'm staying relaxed. And so so playing some stuff that's a little out of my little out of my wheelhouse can be can be um sort of bad for bad for my my practice. So um a lot of my next practice sessions will still be some some timekeeping stuff, but it will also be a lot of actually playing along to my band's tracks. Um, we're playing. A couple of songs that aren't released yet, so uh, some some songs that I only have drum parts demoed out. Um, so so I'll spend a lot of time listening back to those those demo tracks and kind of making sure I've got those parts solidified for songs that we haven't played that much. Here I am at the studio. Um, as you can see, my kid is a little naked at the moment. I got a I got one last practice session in. Uh, about an hour or so. It's uh, two days until the show, so I'm driving to Kansas City tomorrow. i um, getting packed up. As you can see, these are these are some of my essentials. I've got my cymbals. Um, I've got two snare drums I'm taking with me. Um, got to take a backup. If you can take a backup snare drum, take a backup snare drum. Um, my pearl pedal, got my computer bag, uh, with the exception of my duffel bag, which the night before I'm leaving, I have yet to pack, obviously. If you wanna see what is in all of these various bags, uh, leave a comment below. Maybe I'll do a video about that. I do I do have some really cool accessories I've picked up in the last year or so. I, I'm, I'm definitely gonna share, but uh, if you wanna know a little bit more about what snare drums I'm playing, what cymbals I'm playing, or what kind of computer I'm running, um, yeah, leave a comment. Hoping for a handful of hours of sleep Tonight, I usually have a lot of trouble sleeping before I leave for a trip like this. Music just means a lot to me. Performing means a lot to me. This is this is a bigger show. It's gonna be a, a, a bigger crowd than we're used to playing. So I get nervous. So uh, yeah, nine hour drive left and then three hour rehearsal after that. Tuesday is show day and uh, plenty of hanging out. Most importantly, hanging out with the guys. Listen to so many podcasts. Oh, I don't know what else to listen to. It's very windy outside. Yourself playing, bro. Now I'm just gonna film myself drinking this beer. limber up.
done it. Practiced up. The only thing that's left to do is play rock and roll. Are you gonna set up tonight? No, the only thing left to do is play Fortnite, Hunter. Bell. Midnight. Laura's got her toy. It's living the dream.